M0FXB, welcome back to my videos on the PrepCom. This is the MMX0, so it has not got a built-in transceiver, so it's decoding purely from audio, and we're just showing it decoding. Now, you know when you've locked into the right frequency, because the tone and the CWM were virtually flash, you know, all of the time, really. And you can see there, it's, um, I don't think that's English. Um, but it is decoding. Okay. Now, on my Icon 7300, I will show you the settings. Let's leave that running. There is a menu button here. Tap here. Is it going to let me yet? Yeah, and then go location setup. You've got M0 FXB. Andreas Southwest UK and the radio that I'm using and that I'm using a long wire. It's more information and the extra license I put in there, but I'm M0 FXB. Now let me show you my settings on my 7300. Now I'm not saying this is the settings that everyone should use. They're just, I've been here tinkering for about 10 minutes. These are the ones that I have used to decode this signal. Let me just show you that the device there you've got a keyboard just a normal keyboard okay that you can control it with and there's many functions and I've got a light just this is just on the code receive at the moment the audio in is coming from the 7300 I'm not even doing the transmit yet and you can see we've got this is the the, the main thing you want to have this all flashing you know, very similar to the yellow, and it is decoding. So let's look at the radio. I'm powering this radio with just five, five, you know, five volts, uh, a few amps coming from a, a battery bank I've got. So to tune it, I've just been put on the receive. I've just been pressing the RIT and turning it, and at the moment it's on 96, yeah? And you can press and hold if you want, if you want to fine tune. And look, 960, but... And then, so if we just come out of the... The filter window. Let's press and hold. Oh, wrong one. I'll come out, and I've just found the station in the normal way. Now, you'll see that it's. We're told that we have to be off frequency, one thousand three hundred hertz. Um, and there's a very good setup page which I'll link in the description. So we found the station. And I'm actually listening on my computer because you, what you have, you have a cable that goes uh, from the device and it splits into two. One comes, it goes into the radio. The other one you can plug into a powered speaker, like a, a PC speaker, you have to plug it in. I just plug that 3.5 jack straight into my computer and I'm listening to it on my normal computer. So the noise you're hearing in the background is not coming from this box because this box does not have a, um, a built-in transceiver, this one, that you would need the the other version, which is the Delta Mic X-Ray 40, I believe. Uh, that's probably the one I'd recommend, but this is still great for testing. There's the DMX 40. I'll put the website in the description, look, just there. And that has a built-in transceiver. And so if I just press and hold the filter, you'll see that I'm on what I decided to do is go, I've put in actually, it's not what's recommended um, on the website, but I've just got it here adjusted to 650 at the moment. Bandwidth 950, and uh, let's do it right. We've got 650 here, 1.1 kilohertz, filter one, da da da. And then to 650 here. And then we've gone to here, and then we're just sort of turning, pressing RIT and turning until it started decoding. You'll see now the green stop flashing now. And then the other station, look, it started flashing and look, then we start to decode. So, sorry, it's a bit, not the clearest, quite, if I can get a better display here, let me see if I can dim it a little bit. That's better. We've got some English there. 
Let's move to the left, just zoom in a bit more. So I could turn it up on my PC, if you want to hear it. See, the other station is slightly off the frequency and then it doesn't decode. So you're tweaking with the RIT. And then remember, it comes back again. Remember, you can I can hit answer and it will reply. I can type CW using the included keyboard. You've got memories. And what, another thing here you've got called macros as well, which that's for another video. We're on 20 meters. And it's, it's, it does, once you've got the, you know, got it correct, it just starts to decode. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Links in the, in the description.